Good afternoon or almost afternoon. All right, today is Thursday. Welcome to Fat Girls with Two Left Feet. So as you see, this fat girl is exhausted. I just finished my walk. Um, Went up my Odie good, Goody trail by my house, which is what I'm supposed to do when I want to just get in and get out quick, right? Right. Um, And I know it's probably only going to do like three and a half or whatever, which is what I started with, but it has heels. So straight, straight uphill, up, down, up, down. Um, But somehow... After I hit um, my target and it it wasn't quite two miles going, some tell me, keep going, go around the corner to hit two miles. So when I come back, it'll be four. Okay, cool. But as I'm walking, like how I decide where to turn around and be like points of interest on the road, the street or whatever. So once I get past this imaginary point, I'm like, you know what? Um, if I pass it and I haven't hit two miles yet, I'm going to walk all the way to Columbus. So this is now on Redwood. Cause I do Oakwood and I hit Redwood and I normally come back. So that I started walking on Redwood. So I know if I go all the way to Columbus, it's down and up, down and up some more kind of like canyons. And so I'll complete the time, the extra time that I desire, but it won't be quick. And I'm trying to get back in and get back quick so I can do a little work, take my test, do some other shit. So long story short, I did Columbus. <laughs> um, I did jog walk some. I didn't try to do like straight two miles straight away because I don't know if what I did day before yesterday was just like a miracle or whatever. Um, but it is still encouraging me to still try to do a whole mile. So anyway, um, coming back, I ran a bit, but I don't, again, don't know how long the distance was. So then I get back on my regular trail, Oakwood, and, and I'm, it's downhill. And I'm winding down a little bit, but it's residential area. There's potholes, there's dogs, there's driveways, there's cars. So I, it's not really ideal for running. So the moment I get down the hill, I start running. The moment I get down the hill, it tells me, boom, you had um, five miles. So my goal in starting today was, okay, if I can push four miles, but in the back of my mind, feeling bad that I've been doing five. But I'm like, if I could push four, cool. It's not going to always be four. It's not going to always be five. So, um... I get to the bottom of the hill and I hit five and I know I still maybe got about 10 bucks left to get home. I'm like, cool. So I just started running from there and I was like, so wherever it stops when I get home, I don't know. I ran that amount. So it did like 5.72. So that mean I ran the seven point at the point seven two. Now coming back, I had to detour a little bit because it was a crazy dude. So I had to turn off on a side street. So I know going my regular way, the hill was a little higher. So I would have Probably got some more steps in, but that's potatoes, potatoes. So um, I did the point seven two without getting tired per se from the running. But my legs did start hurting, start burning. This is the first time in my whole uh, jogging, walking since September, October that my legs actually start burning. It didn't even burn that day when I accidentally did the 7.8. Um, two, three months ago, I accidentally did 5.6. Um so anyway, I don't know, is it just because um, I worked them out two days ago, running those two miles or whatever? I mean, literally, I've been in the house 10 minutes and they're still burning. But it's okay, you know. I got the Epsom bath running, cow going, get a revamp, and then hopefully God will, and I'll be back out there Saturday like normal. So um, I'm aspiring to make it to Mare Island and do their trail. So that's my goal for this weekend. So we'll see. But thank you for joining Fat Girls and stay tuned. Peace.